ما تنساش تعمل اشتراك في القناة يلا بينا Class B fires involve combustible and flammable liquids such as gasoline and kerosene. Extinguishing agents include dry chemicals, carbon dioxide, and AFFF. This stored pressure extinguisher contains multi-purpose dry chemical powder which interferes with the chemical chain reaction of fire. Pull the pin, point the nozzle, squeeze the lever, and sweep across the base of the flames. Since the powder has no cooling action, be especially alert for reignition. This is a cartridge operated extinguisher with a standard dry chemical. This is a carbon dioxide self expellent extinguisher. To activate this cartridge operated extinguisher, Pull the pin and press this lever which pressurizes the extinguisher. Point the nozzle, approach the fire and squeeze the lever to discharge the powder, applying it in the same way as with a stored pressure extinguisher. This self-expellent CO2 extinguisher is operated by removing the pin and pressing the lever. The CO2 gas discharges from the horn, replacing the oxygen around the fire and smothering it. Sweep across the base of the flames, taking care not to scatter the fuel. Do not touch the discharge horn as it rapidly becomes extremely cold and can cause injury. Use this extinguisher with particular caution in enclosed areas where the level of carbon dioxide in the air could reach dangerous proportions. Some extinguishers contain a foam agent for flammable liquid fire. Direct the stream as lightly as possible on the surface in front of the fire. Gently sweep and splash the foam side to side, gradually working toward the back so as not to disturb the foam blanket being formed. Care must be taken not to create an opening in the blanket which could result in reignition. Other agents commonly used on Class B fires are multi-purpose dry chemicals and AFFF.